An ice age is a period of colder global temperatures and recurring glacial expansion capable of lasting hundreds of millions of years. The Pleistocene Epoch is a geological time period that includes the last ice age, when glaciers covered huge parts of the globe. This epoch began about 2.6 million years ago and ended 11,700 years ago. During this time, the Earth's climate repeatedly changed between very cold periods during which glaciers covered large parts of the world and very warm periods during which many of the glaciers melted. The cold periods are called glacials and the warm periods are called interglacials. The glacial periods lasted much longer than the interglacials. Today we are in a warm interglacial period. Scientists are still learning about how ice ages occur, but we know they are driven by a series of factors such as fluctuating carbon dioxide levels, Earth's position in the solar system and how much heat our planet receives from the sun. The shape of Earth's orbit varies on a 96,000 year cycle and the planet is cooler when it is pulled by Jupiter's gravity farther from the sun. The last glacial period began about 100,000 years ago and the ice age peaked during the last glacial maximum about 20,000 years ago when glaciers covered vast swathes of North America, Europe, South America and Asia. At that time, global temperatures were about 6 degrees Celsius lower than they are today and the global sea level was more than 400 feet lower than it is today and glaciers covered approximately 8% of Earth's surface and 25% of Earth's land area. Today, glaciers cover approximately 3% of Earth's surface and 11% of Earth's land area. Ice Age conditions were also drier than today. Because most of the water on Earth's surface was ice, there was little precipitation. Rainfall was about half of current levels. The sea level was much lower and the shorelines were typically much farther out because glaciation trapped water in ice sheets. Earth was warming as it exited the Pleistocene Epoch about 11,700 years ago. By the start of the warmer Holocene Epoch, humans were in position to take advantage of the favorable conditions by developing agriculture and domestication techniques. As the glacial and interglacial periods happen in cycles, it is very likely that Earth will turn cold again, possibly within the next several thousand years. But we have to keep in mind that human activities today are impacting climate on a global scale. So when we predict future climate changes, including the next glacial period, we need to consider the changes that humans are causing. Scientists continue to study the evidence of these important periods, both to gain more insight into the Earth's history and to help determine future climatic events. That's all for today's video, like and subscribe to the channel and see you in the next one.